konnichiwa. Welcome to another Hachimaki TV travel vlog and on this video, we will give you 15 things you should know about Azure Urban Resort Residences at Paranaque City, Philippines. On this channel, we value your overall well-being and traveling is one of our way to manage or avoid stress. And alam naman natin that stress can negatively impact both our physical and mental health. So if you're demotivated, frustrated, and feeling lonely, take time to pause, take a break, breathe, travel alone, or travel with your friends. And you do you, Minasan. So let's travel and explore. Ja, hajimi masho. We did our reservation through Facebook. A week before our stay at Azur, we paid 500 pesos non-refundable fee to reserve the room na napili namin. The room was worth 3,000 pesos, good for 4 person. Very accommodating naman yung contact person namin, kaya hindi kami nahirapan sa pag-reserve and pag-book ng accommodation. We were required to submit a copy of our vaccination card and valid ID before our scheduled stay at Azur. And during the day na pumunta kami, they still ask to see our valid IDs to give us a visitor's pass. I think for travelers that owns a private vehicle, you can easily get to Azure because of mobile apps like Waze and Google Map. But for DIY travelers like us, we used public transportation. Sumakay ako ng jeepney going to MRT Guadalupe and from MRT Guadalupe, bumaba ako sa MRT Ayala since just downstairs ay ang bus terminal going to Bikutan. Bumaba kami sa SM Bikutan and we walked 5 minutes from SM Bikutan going to Azure. We find Azure convenient because it's a few minutes walk to SM Bikutan and public market. Hindi na kami nagdala ng madaming gamit and food since we purchased almost all of the things that we needed at SM Bikutan. There's a public market then near the resort so napaka convenient talaga. The first thing we did is to contact the person who booked our accommodation. We were told na pumunta sa Santorini building to check in at the lobby. Since we were not so familiar sa lugar ay nagtanong na rin kami sa mga gwardiya. They were accommodating so wala naman kaming naging problema to locate the building. When we were at the lobby, sinundo kami ng aming contact person and she accompanied us sa aming room. She even gave us a quick briefing about the room and told us what are the do's and don'ts sa resort. Even though we already sent them our vaccination card and valid IDs online, we were instructed to also bring our IDs to present it at the lobby for us to get a visitor's pass. Also, we needed to always bring our visitor's pass going in and out the building. Kailangan ding isurrender ang visitor's pass upon checkout because it is worth 500 pesos pag nawala. Pool access is cost 250 pesos. Pool access is not included sa binayaran namin sa room. It's optional if gusto mong maligo. But okay lang naman na hindi ka magbayad ng 250 pesos if you have no plan na maligo sa swimming pool. We were lucky because yung room na nabook namin had an overlooking view sa swimming pool and kita almost entire resort. We booked a room at Santorini building and it was at 8th floor.
We booked a studio type condo unit and the room was so convenient. Merong isang bed, we were allowed to use the kitchen and they have kitchenwares and utensils. Merong TV, one electric fan, and the room was fully air conditioned. There were two chairs and one table sa balcony, so the room was so worth it. We had a free access to their Wi-Fi, so we were able to watch Netflix and post in our social media accounts. Full hours is from 7 a.m. to 12 noon and 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. They also have bar, a dynamic hangout in the middle of Azur, children's pool and playground, volleyball area, and basketball court. Azur has a very own wave machine that creates fun waves every few minutes. It surely provides plenty of fun for swimmers who enjoy a little adventure at the pool. Clothes, especially those made of cotton, are not allowed at the pool. Absorbent materials such as cotton can break down in the water and can clog pool filters. I've seen different swimwear when we went at Azure just like swimsuit for females, trunks for males, swim shirt, and rush guards. We also included convenience stores like 7-Eleven and Lawson inside Azure because it's just a few minutes away from our room so we can easily go and purchase anything especially during midnight. So hindi na kami nag worry to get outside the resort just to buy what we needed. So thank you so much and yun lang muna sa ngayon minasang. I hope that you get something important and helpful from this video. See you on our next travels. Ja, mata ne!